So here we have the digital holster series, and we have six different sizes for different types of cameras. And what's really important about this series is that these are really custom fitted for a very particular cameras. So we're going to start with the smallest, we're going to go up, and we're going to show you really quickly what these holsters hold. So real quick, this is the 5, the 10, the 20, the 30, the 40, and the 50. Okay, so going back to the 5, this is really for mirrorless cameras. So this is the Olympus OMD EM5, right, with their kit lens, the, the 12 to 50. And this can fit with the uh, lens hood in position. So just a nice small little guy. Digital holster 10, that's going to fit your Rebel cameras your or your Nikon uh, D5300 series. Um, this is specifically the uh, T5i with the kit lens and also will fit with the lens hood in the shooting position. Now, when we jump up to the digital holster 20, that fits the more of your standard size DSLR, your Nikon DA10, your 5D Mark III, with your 24 to 70 2.8 uh, with the lens hood in the shooting position. Right? right, so this is one of the most unique uh, features of these bags is that we have this pop down mechanism. This is really nice because when you're actually shooting, you want your lens in position, but when you're traveling and just walking around, you want the bag to be as small as possible. So this just simply zips up and down. Right. So, jumping over to the digital holster 30, this is more for your 70 to 200, right, with your standard size body. So, mm -hmm. again, your 5D Mark III, your Nikon DA10. Um, with that pop down, it does fit with the lens hood in the shooting position. Right, and this is actually, we have two different bags here that do this, but this is uh, one of the few bags available in the market where you can actually have a 70 to 200 with the lens hood in position straight down, ready to pull out and shoot. Right, and with that pop-down feature, it allows you to keep this, yep. um, keep that hood in position. Mm -hmm. So, moving over to the digital holster 40, this is when you start to get up into the pro size, those gripped bodies. So here we have a, a Canon 1DX, um, also will fit your Nikon D3, D4, uh, and the 40 fits a 24 to 70 2 8. Again, with that lens hood in the shooting position with the pop-down. Right, and you can see, look at the shape of the top. It's really designed for the full square pro shape. And even if you have a bottom bracket on it or something else, it'll still fit on the inside. Mm -hmm. As we move up to the 50, it's the same lens as the 30, but again, you have that pro size gripped body. Um, the Canon 1DX, the Nikon D3, D4, um, with the 70 200 28. Again, lens hood in the shooting position with that pop down feature. So right. let's. Let's yeah, let's look at around. let's look at this one. Okay, we're gonna move the gear around here just so we can focus on one specific size. So in the front we have the stretchy pocket. This is great for lens caps, just things you need on the fly that you can drop in there. Mm -hmm. um, on the side we have a little accessory pocket. Uh, all of these bags come with a seam sealed rain cover, and this is where that rain cover hides in here. You can also use this for memory cards, batteries, you know, whatever you need, mm -hmm. essentials for your camera. Another detail is if you look at the front, you see it's actually following the shape of the camera, which is completely unique to Think Tank Photo. We actually have a patent on this shape. And also, let's show a little bit more closely the pop down mechanism. You can see. Right here, there's a zipper slider on the side. I just pull this, it goes around the bag, and then it pops down. It's very easy to use to make it go up and down to you know, expand and contract. So an absolute key feature for these products. It also has a business card holder in the top, you know, so you can, for identification purposes. And on the back, we have our modular attachment system. And it does actually work with our belt system. Okay. So as you can see, this is the rotate or lock um, patented technology that we have here. So you can lock it into these webbing loops on the belt, mm -hmm. or as I like it, to have it freely slide around. So if I if I want to shoot, I move everything to the back. I can take my shot. If I need to change lenses or grab my camera. I have it there at the ready. Right. And this again, this is part of our modular system. So check out our our other accessories. Our um, you know, lens attachment systems as well. Another detail I forgot is most of the sizes have this webbing loop on the side, and that's so that you can attach other modular components to it. It also has what appears to be a compression strap down here, but it's actually, the purpose of this is that once you put the modular piece on, you take this, you wrap it around the bag, and it keeps it from flopping around. And this is the lens changer, um, I'm sorry, this is the Skin 75 pop-down. This holds your uh, 70 to 200. 
uh, 2.8, so it can just hold that right on the side. So the bags are expandable. Right, we also have other accessories. We have a, a chest mount system that allows you to wear this on the front of your body and secure it in place when you're doing really active activities, like skiing or things like that. It's, a, it's actually a very sophisticated harness in the way that it works. That's the digital holster harness. Now, right. just going back to the whole series, they all come with a, a padded uh, shoulder strap, also with non-slip. And so this is all metal hardware, so really nice, high quality, durable stuff that just clips onto the side D-rings here. So. This holster system can act as a, as a shoulder bag, can act as a, a belt mount, can act as a chest mount, so you have a lot of different mm -hmm. options with this thing. Also yeah. can just stuff inside a, a day pack if you need mm -hmm. to, because it's nice and compact. So that's the digital holster series. From Think Tank Photo.